stuck in your house and you're thinking there's nothing to do. But you can't say that anymore because I got you covered. Black Widow, we have our film critic, Felipe Solis. Now I've received so much training that I'm going to do this myself and eat this fire. Oh my God. It is National Banana Split Day, and I'm honestly just tired of being in the studio. Time to get out of your comfort zone. Maybe learn a new language, organize your home. I got one even better for you. Experience a new culture. I just got an alert from the El Paso Animal Services. They said it was raining cats and dogs last night. Um, <laughs> now, although the city of Phoenix has canceled three other major fireworks festivities, here are three things around the valley that you will see amazing pop, pop, pop fireworks light show. If you live in the borderland, you don't have to go to infinity and beyond to experience Disney magic. An El Paso short-term rental company, My Experience Matters, has transformed one of their homes to a Toy Story themed house. We chose Toy Story because we can never go wrong with Toy Story. I don't think anybody can outgrow Toy Story. Located in Far East El Paso, the Toy Story home features three bedrooms and two full baths for an average of $149 a night. As soon as you walk in, you're greeted by Pizza Planet, uh, all black walls, black themed, to kind of give you the feel like you're in a Pizza Planet. You got two bedrooms to the side. You got to your left-hand side, you got the Buzz Lightyear room. You got a big Buzz painting. You got a fun fact about Buzz Lightyear in that room. You can experience something like Disneyland in a home. So we wanted to make something a little bit more easier for families here locally. My favorite room in the Toy Story house easily has to be Andy's room because check out the details, everybody. From the clouds on the wall all the way to my man Ham right here on the dresser and also the 25th edition anniversary Toy Story Adidas shoes right here in every single room gives it the full experience of a Toy Story home. I'd like to strive in, in bringing a next level vacation. There's an additional charge for the house to be professionally deep clean. However, this gives families a safe place to staycation in the pandemic. So we want to make sure we give an experience in the house. So when deciding which house we wanted to do next, it was just a vision for us. It's just a dream. Jay Russell, KTSM 9 News. It's a historic racetrack and that it's the home for the quarter horse racing Triple Crown. In 2020, fans were not able to see the fantastic view of Riodoso Downs. But this weekend, with free admission and free parking, you could sit in this seat to see some of the best racing right here at the mountain. With more than 20 years on the job, director of marketing of Rio Doso Downs, Tim Keithley, says the fan interaction completes the experience at the track. What we really missed last year were the fans. And now that we hopefully are past the pandemic, those fans will return. And there's not a better place to come enjoy an outdoor activity than, than the horse races at Rio Doso Downs. A quarter horse runs a quarter of a mile at full speed. This Memorial Day weekend at Rio Doso Downs Racetrack features the top two and three year old quarter horses in the world competing. It's a $3 million race, so it's the richest quarter horse race in the United States. Just in case you're planning on placing a bet on that special horse, pro tip. There's no wrong way to do it. That's the part that I enjoy the most about going to the horse races, is everyone has an opinion. Whether your method is betting on your mother's birthday or going with the lucky number seven, you're guaranteed to have a good time. If you're coming to the races for the first time, I mean, just expect to enjoy the atmosphere. That's what I would tell you. Although you can watch races online, there's nothing like live sports. You just can't really quite get the same enthusiasm out of it. But when you are within feet, and I mean feet, of a quarter horse standing on the rail watching that quarter horse go by, there's not a bigger thrill. Tim 
Keeley is right about that. No feeling like it.